There he comes. There's a car. And he's also the meat sweats and God knows what else. <laughs> so it's called the title track off the CD, Catholic Cemetery. I live on the road that runs into Catholic Cemetery. And at the end of Catholic Cemetery, it's a Catholic Cemetery. And I thought to myself, what would the priest and those children have to say in these graves? Hmm. I wrote a song about it. Here we go. Just check it. Oh, no, no. 
Just right in my head. I'm going to have a friend of ours show off, J.C. Nichols. He wrote this song, and we mollified it for him. Rude Awakening. All right, what, what is it about, J.C.? What's the song about? Uh, it's about coming to terms with reality that surrounds you. <laughs> You say, why is it a good morning if you solved all our problems? Damn good. This new year without fear and our tear. Oh, Mollus! 
This was called No Scene. Which means, if you know the words, know the chorus, come up here and join us. It's called I'll Bleed For You. It's about giving your heart and soul to a good friend and being there for them, family member, good person. Talk about good people. We've got Brian Klosky, who actually recorded the, the CD, BFE. Bum, fuck, Egypt. 
This is going out live. And he's also playing a lead on this song. I'll bleed for you. start no shit. It's about a male whore we know around this town. Nah, it's just about a whore. <laughs> That's a random Male one. or female, transgender, whatever. <coughs> Somebody who gets around, that's all. Thank you. 
This next song I wrote in 1984 when I was 18 years old. It's called Experiment in Fear. Ronald and Reagan had us going to war. I ain't gonna lie, I was scared. Wrote a song about it, it's called Experiment in Fear. And this is Morbid Rob, if he even needs an introduction. You know, stop. A legend in town. No. Yes, he is. Stop. A connoisseur of records. True. And all things metal and punk and whatever. Yes. And all things of the Book of Mormon. Yes. yes. <laughs> In the Book of Satan. <laughs> for about 20 fucking years. <laughs> Our lives have been intertwined. Yes, they are. And uh, it's not too bad. I gotta be honest. I love these motherfuckers. And Mike, too. Yeah. Uh, he's not a Rivera, but... <laughs> the Lozano and I have also been involved in many adventures. And Rob things. is the fourth honorary Latino <laughs> member of um, Malasaga. He may look white. He may look Caucasian. I but inside, he's all Latino, baby. I you know what I'm saying? That. Oh, that's, I got the wrong gender. I'm sorry, the wrong national. Oh, goes a pogo. All right, here's what's called, it goes out to your dogs. If you got a dog, we wrote a song about him. Uh, God All of the, the dogs. dogs. of the past. God of the dogs. The first song I ever did with you guys. 100 years ago, and then I'll be gone. Yeah. Why are you 
Norman Roth. Thanks for having me since you started. I appreciate it. Gracias. I think he's stroking out up here. I can't see what Chris had wrote, but you know, I love that guy. He's such a peaceful cat, a great drummer, a great soul. And, um, you know what? So it's called Hispanic Panic. It's a song about. Latinos are running in America, kind of like what's happening now. <coughs> and people are getting scared. So like um, the generation before us, they start branding Hispanics to put them in their place. I wrote a song about it called Hispanic Panic. <laughs> together, bringing them all together, so thank you. Please donate something. This is, you know, they can use it. They're using it. To look, look what they're doing here. Thank you, Diggity Day, man. Great job. Uh, all right, I'm done sucking people off for the rest of the night. We're just going to play our set like we're at the beer mug. I'm 
Now this song's about your mom. John Holmes. <laughs>
Oh, you're a silly God. How oh, your God is so silly. This one's called Vamos a Gozar. It's an old Spanish low tour, low folklore song. Hey, it is. We made this shit up in my basement a little bit ago. Um, it's about drinking and shenanigans afterwards. <laughs> This was called La Petola. <laughs> it's, a, it's a sad song. It's a, about a guy catching his wife and his um, neighbor doing it, and he shoots them both. But for some reason, he did a, he did a Crosby, Bill Crosby, and he was able to beat the, the rap. So he's out back in the street. So we wrote a song about it called La he's Petola. Right there. Oh, shit. I had to. I did it. Hey, there's something against you can't get. Try twice for the same crime, so I did it. <laughs>
Alex, thank you for everything you do too. Alex Aurelia. Gracias, amigo. Thank you, Lamar. Thank you, Pekka. Pekka. Muchas gracias a todos. It's time to shut it down. These guys got lives, unlike us. <laughs>